Hi gamers, I'm Cyber Settler, and today we are playing Space Engineers. Today I want to show you something I've been working on, and this is um, a system that will be uh, loading and unloading uh, modules to the Eagle Transporter. So currently here is uh, this is the Moon sand Sandbox uh, base, and yeah, I have set up uh, a, a, like a testing or a prototype of the system I want to install in the base. So this one is um, meant like at this point we are now, the, the highest point. This is where the Eagle Transporter will land. And then uh, we have like this platform um, system here that will bring the Eagle Transporter down and it will then uh, unload and load the cargo or the or the modules so for example yeah for example we have now here a module uh, stored right this is the, the, the store position of the module and now we just have to load it right so for that we have this system here with a with a piston it's, it's like a crane this this part here the crane hangs from a, um, a rotor and then comes a piston and then some other pistons so first uh, we need to rotate the the crane so we uh, press this red button here that activates the rotor and there we go now we activate the horizontal um, pistons there we go and this will pick up basically it will pick up the the module right and then we hit the vertical uh, pistons it goes down but also we have to um, enable the ports there we are and now it's connected now we activate the vertical uh, pistons again vertical and horizontal at the same time yes so now it's bring it bringing the whole thing and now we can start rotating the the crane again with the button and it's rotating and we can activate the horizontal pistons again horizontal and <coughs> there vertical it comes down gently there we go now we um, turn off the ports go for the vertical again and the horizontal there we go so now the the crane is retracted and now we can we can r rise the the platform that is the two i think yes now it will ah but for that i need uh, to activate the um, here the the ports load ports on there we go now it's connected you see now it's connected 
And now the next step would be to to rise the whole uh, platform up. So this is done with uh, one button here. So you see how everything is rising, right? And then the Eagle Transporter will be ready to launch. And there we go. So, yeah, and then um, the other, then would we would have like the other um, the other way, right? Like uh, the the eagle transporter comes and and lands in the base. I I place like these um, parts here. By the way, this is the the industrial DLC, and I place this. Um, these um, plates here uh, to to make sure that the eagle transporter will will land in the in the spot I needed to to land because all this system depends the on the position uh, on the position of the of the module and the eagle transporter on the platform. So for the uh, for the storing, so we hit again the one button to bring the whole thing down, right? So this is um, all. All the the platform is um, supported by these pistons here. These, these are the base pistons, and then we have a secondary uh, platform with a module that um, is uh, supported by this other piston system here and yeah what we do now is that we disconnect we need to disconnect here the load um, port so there it's disconnected now and now we need to lower um, to lower the the secondary platform so we do this by pressing the two and there we go it's lowering the secondary platform there and now we can just um, use the crane so first the horizontal let's turn on the ports the vertical and there it's connected the vertical again and the horizontal So it's now bringing the module back and we now need to press this button here for the rotor and there we go and we can now activate the horizontal again and now it's being stored so i had previously uh, in the moon base alpha i had a, a different system but at the end it, it was um, very complicated and, and at the end there was some some glitch now the vertical again there was some glitch like in the platform when uh, when it was um, I had like this system with with a platform that changed from one piston to another but this was somehow glitchy let's disconnect them and again um, vertical and horizontal 
So there, we are coming back to the initial position where the the module was in its in its stored position. And by the way, here we could have like um, because this is like one storing place, but you see that around this storing place, uh, potentially there's more space, right? So we could have a platform in 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 all these three sides right so we could have instead of one um, module stored here we could have three one uh, one in each side of this uh, cube here and then we, we could have three like a cluster so these platforms could um, could um, move with uh with pistons right uh so when i want to retrieve um each one of these um, modules then i will activate the pistons of its own hangar so in fact we could have like three um three different um modules stored in one cluster here and there could be another cluster there also, I was thinking that I could even uh, store um, Eagle Transporters, like to have several Eagle Transporters. So in this next level, there would be another crane that could take the Eagle Transporter um, from, this, um, from these ports, like connecting to these ports, and then bringing the, 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 the Eagle Transporter uh, like this other crane so it would lift the Eagle Transporter, it will retract the, the the crane, it will rotate to the side and store the Eagle Transporter. And this is uh, quite similar to what we saw in Space 1999, right? Like we we see that the like the Moon Base Alpha ha had this. Um, platforms that would um, uh, would uh, be like elevators they will lower the eagle transporter to be stored and in the lower parts there will be like hangars with many eagle transporters so this is what i want to do so now um yeah i wanted to to show you guys um what i've been doing in the in the because this is the sandbox i i want to show you what i've been doing in the survival so let's hop to the survival So this is the survival world. <clears throat> and here I have the, the, the moon base alpha that I've um, shown in other videos. Like when um, I showed this, um, also this system to, to store modules. But this is, uh, I, I think this is an improvement and it's um, a simpler uh, mechanism uh, to do all these things the other one was uh, complicated and and it had um yeah some glitch as i as, uh, as i said so let's see this is the survival here i want to show you guys what I've been doing so I have the Eagle transporter already in the in place as you can see here so there's already this um, this platform right As you can see there's there's a platform here 
and yeah currently i have the the crane module attached to the eagle transporter down here i'm finishing like the the secondary platform and all this is i i've been uh, using this industrial dlc by the way it's great like it really um for me it it um it's one of the best uh, DLCs uh, because I like very much these structures. They give a, a nice touch to the to the base, and you can see here that the second the secondary um, pistons, the secondary sorry um, platform, is supported by these pistons here. And I've made like um, also this system of. Uh, uh, this conveyor system uh, to be able to load things into Eagle Transporter and to um, yeah and to load and unload and these are the other pistons like the main ones the base pistons and I'm also using uh, a mod uh, for concrete so these uh, these columns that you see here will be filled with concrete and yeah this is good because you can then uh, make use of gravel that <laughs> otherwise is waste i think also gravel is used for some um, nuclear reactor components but otherwise it's it's just waste yes and here i have like the the the, the former um system you see here to store uh, modules and it was taking this platform and um, yeah it was uh, somehow transferring these platforms around several piston systems at the end this was this was too complicated and here was the like the gates were the the the, the the module would be loaded into the Eagle Transporter but even the Eagle Transporter could not be stored itself so this is what we are doing here we have like this huge um, platform system here so I will be showing this to you guys once it's um, it's done it's a work in progress right now I, I decided to do this before uh, the mission to 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 earth like uh, to deploy a rover on earth and this was because I um, at the end I decided that the Eagle Transporter should return itself and land in and like in this main platform in the center so this is what um, we're going to do uh, in the next episode so I think that's everything for now guys um, I'll be uh, doing more of these uh, videos well when when I finish the, the 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 platform system I will be making um, another video to show you how it's um, it's coming uh, how it came together and yeah this is uh, everything for this episode i hope you like the video and hope to see you in the in the next one so this is cyber settler signing off